for uh, clicking us in. Mm -hmm. Nice. We're already streaming to Facebook team. What a day, what a day. Let's share some wins. Thanks for hopping in my inbox box, Susan. <laughs> Those slight things do wonders for the soul and therefore in turn for the body. Thank you. Oh, Susan, I apologize, Ms. Robin. <laughs> I'm looking dead at your face, but I say Susan. I know that's Robin. Yeah, thanks for the inbox, Dom. Yeah, still a little pain, but we digress. Just so we don't cut anyone off from the information, I'll save that to the end. It was another great session. It's amazing how much he can pack so much into that four minute, minutes and 26 seconds he gave us today. <laughs> but he gave a mouth full. And it, it, it's something that I was just thinking that. I have a good, good girlfriend that we went to college together. And we stay connected. Our first, our freshman year in college at that, um, we stay connected over the years and we ended up not working far from one another. And we knew that. So when I got into the business, she knew what I did prior. So I got into the business and I reached out to her to let her know. Uh, I was in Eric's uh, course on last year, the accelerator course. And she was the one I set up a meeting with, a sit down. <laughs> to talk about it so we did a sit down and she agreed to do a basket for me and yada yada and I didn't follow up I didn't uh ask her well how did those other things go for you because you know you had them do you still have them at least so he was right on track with my thought that's my number one and there are a couple others Three years ago, when I introduced myself to this business, I, I kind of let it fall off. But what, what I know now and the confidence that I have in the education I have in my business now, I feel more comfortable going to them knowing my goal, <laughs> knowing my goal and expecting the rejections. Yeah. So what's going on in the week? We're in Thursday, team. There's still a lot of week left. Any schedules for the weekend? I am working on events. Uh, um, there's lots of events going on um, this summer. So that is what I am working on getting into events. My apologies, team. I didn't want that to be an emergency coming midday like this. So if there are no wins, I can talk very, very slow. <sighs> if you would like, we talked about, and listen, it was so quick, I had time to uh, revisit it. <laughs> We talked about restarting the conversation. That was my goal of sharing my story with you. So this person that I just mentioned, uh, she's going to be the first that I reach out to and uh, ask for another sit down and just restart the conversation. So that's what we talked about today. Circle back around to where you began and some of those who you Offer the opportunity, we are in a 90-day run, or uh, ask them to take a look at your jury because we are about sales as well, or even uh, look at hosting the basket party, whatever your goal may be with this person because you know your interaction. Another key point you should know going in, these are people that you may have had prior contact with. You got that? You've had the conversation before, or you've made the pitch before, or whatever. It's done before, but... Just for some reason, you allow that to fall by the wayside or it the, the old famous, oh, I'm too busy. I'll call you back. I'll call you back. I'll call you. And we never get around to that call back. So the challenge is just to restart the conversation. Just get back connected. Hey, how you doing? How's the family? Any summer plans? Let's reconnect. I, he didn't per se mention this team, but it goes along with what we've already been discussing, which is getting in front of those. I do believe this is another script to uh, when you uh, make those sit downs, uh, when you schedule those, 
this is one of those scripts that you can use. I know we talked prior, but make sure you make it really impressionable. Have a real conversation. If it, if it veers left from what you come to focus on, allow it to flow that way naturally. The worst thing that we can do is push and pull and try to divert the things the way that we want to go because someone will fall off real quick. They'll sense that frustration we've talked about and they'll notice that. So make it to where if you were the prospect, if you were the client, if you were the client that purchased once or twice and never returned, because remember, we're reaching all aspects. But this challenge is to uh, go for reconnecting. Ask them clearly. Uh, things have changed in the business. Would you like some updates? I'd love to share some things that has happened in my business. Like this is real. This is building credibility back here. You know, you're not saying that per se, but this is the attitude. This is the presence that you're giving them. Um, and, and remember this part too. I shared prior to that I had a recruit and I had known them for less than a week and they were part of my team versus someone I've been trying to recruit for the last year and a half, almost two years, and they're still not on board team. But know that situations change for people. Who knows, tomorrow may bring a whole nother livelihood for some and they are just looking for this opportunity. So don't be... Look, get out of our heads and don't think for others. It is our responsibility to give the information, give the education about our product and allow them to make an informed decision. So let's not make that decision for them. <laughs> All right, let's work on those, those stories is what it is. Because Eric opened as he usually does with a story. And uh, the story was about... Mm, it's just my mind. It was it was a pretty good one. It was quick too. He did a story. He opened up really quick. Just you never know. Situations may change, so don't be afraid to ask the questions. All right. Use that time to catch up. And as we always encourage you, post the results in the group. And that is all. <laughs> so I love some discussion behind that. What are some of the appeals? Because I know I have a fear in my own head about reaching out to some people. Because someone reached out to me and was like, listen, I don't want to talk shop at all. And I, I almost like all caps and <laughs> exclamation marks. I was like, ooh, I, that was a damaged relationship. And I came back to the table like, what do you do with the damaged relationship? Well, you give them some time and then you try to reach back out. I'm nervous about that one, but I intend to reach back out. I know we talked about you presenting some of my product. You know, how do you feel today? <laughs> I got to eat that frog. Robin, I can't hear you. Turn up your volume. Can you hear me? Hello? Not yet. Can you see what's going on, Kelly? I can hear you okay, Robin. Can you oh, hear me? me? Oh, you know what? It may be me. Wait. Oh, my goodness. One second, team. I may have this Bluetooth. Yeah, I can hear you, too. Oh, my apology. It must be a horrible sound. Oh, my apologies, team. Oh, we heard you just fine, Tanya. You just can't hear us. <laughs> oh, okay. When it's so close, I'm like, oh my goodness, what is going on? Can okay. you hear us okay now? Can you? Yeah, can you hear? Yeah. Okay, so one thing I have done recently is I've been reaching out to um, customers that I haven't um, seen in a while or people I have um, met at events and emailing them and just letting them know about the new app. And so that has been great, a way to get those conversations going again and just letting them know of this new way that you can look at all the jewelry I have and you don't have to wait to... Um, see me at events or come to 
my house. So that's been awesome. Excellent idea, Robin. I just heard that cross so many boards. You're t keeping the conversation going. You're directing them to your site and you're making it easier for them. I think one of the biggest issue I have about my replicated website is people don't want to sign into the, make an account. They don't want to do that part. My personal website doesn't uh, require you to do that. So it's easier back there. But I noticed that <laughs> because, because in the last prior weeks when I'm reaching out like, hey, you mind visiting support, yada, yada. And they'll be like, sure. And then the last couple of weeks I've been getting, oh, I got to make an account. Oh, I got to sign in. Oh, I got to get these numbers. Oh, can you do it? And I'm like, okay, that's the issue back there. They don't want to make the account. So I have to make it easier for them. Yeah, the easier it is for them than because they don't want to take the time to do all that creating accounts and stuff. And so, yeah. So I'm and, loving, and, loving this. And Eric alluded to that in the conversation today. Make it easy if you have to go to their house, if you have to meet them at a neutral place, after school, in the parking lot. Make it convenient for them for these meetups as well. It doesn't have to be so strict and structured. But get, let, let's get them a uh, schedule. Hey, team, hey, team, it's awfully quiet. It makes me nervous when it's quiet. <laughs> Anything on, on over on Facebook? I'll say, something real, I'll say something real quick. This is Jermaine. Um, this morning, I received a message um from a previous consultant now i have not i have not reached out to her and it's been quite a while and actually we never even talked about I, I don't know how i just skipped my mind that she was a previous consultant but she's actually looking to sign up again and she wants to sign up under me so preferably that's going to go down um next friday so uh, I, that was totally off my radar the old adage if you keep working your business, people will see that and they will want to be a part of that. <laughs> so yeah, she's been watching. She, Eric said that today too. Make sure you put this in your dialogue. Ooh, hopefully I wrote, I wrote it down. Are you up for that? I don't know what your situation has changed, but maybe, and always he was telling the compliments. You may have forgotten about our previous conversation about so-and-so, but I haven't. You've been on my mind all the time because you are this and you are that. That's your complimentary error. And I believe if you if you were to do so and so, that one plus one will equal 10. <laughs> I feel good just hearing that. <laughs> I'm definitely incorporating that. One plus one with you equals 10. So yeah, don't forget the compliments and yeah. Those are just some things you can say to revisit. <laughs> you say one plus one equal 10. Are you open for updates? Yes or no? I don't want to waste your time. Remember, we want to keep it flowing. So you're just in the rush as they are. But when can we? What if I, if I can you? Thanks for sharing, Jomaine. Yeah, great. Yeah, those tools work. And I'm reminded again, once she becomes your business partner, the recruiting continues. That's one thing that I loved about joining Paparazzi in the beginning. The tools were unlimited. I got so much information so fast and I had to learn to filter it by my business needs. But yeah, there's a lot of information back there. Anything, anything, any questions from prior days? We will meet again uh, tomorrow, same time. Eric's been quick all week, so I wouldn't doubt if uh, he might be quick on a Friday too. So if he's quick, I'll go ahead and jump on a little earlier team. So you may be able to check back. Yeah, check in uh, maybe about a quarter to because we were done like by 205. 
Eastern Standard Time. I looked up five minutes. And that was time enough for me to click off the button and scroll. <laughs> like, oh, it's too old time. Yeah, but a great information. Any hesitation about going into the revisiting, recircling, and reconnecting? What's the strong hesitation in your mind? Because I, I hope that all of us has flashed at least a face or a name that we'd love to reach back out to. Is there any hesitation there? And what is that hesitation? No hesitation. Just hope they respond on my end. That's, <laughs> that's my problem. <laughs> well, you know... Uh, it's Regina, right? I'm not wearing my yes. reading. Miss Regina, you know that it that part is about filling the funnel. You should have so many rotating that you don't even notice that. So many others are, but you don't notice the ones that aren't because of that honey is flowing. So yeah, when that one comes, don't stop. Don't let up. Reach out to mm -hmm. 10 more. That comment yeah, was from, from uh, Jermaine. Was, yeah, you uh, you said yeah, Jermaine you said you was yeah, that was Jermaine, that was Jermaine that said that. Oh, I was, that wasn't I, you that said no no uh, reservation. You just hope they respond. No, no, that was me. That was me, Jermaine. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I saw Regina screen. Oh, yeah, her face came up, but it was me that's. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I'm confused enough. And I, the pain, listen, <laughs> it, it got to be me. I, I had an uh, encounter on the weekend with uh, someone at a service station. Um, and the manager allowed me to put out my cards. It's attached. I put it out in two places there. In the service station itself, but it had a restaurant attached to it. And they had the things out to put your business cards there. Oh, nice. So I put it in both places. And then one of the ladies was very interested. But the issue she had was giving me her phone number so that I could get stuff to her. She gave me her email. Social but media? Come, mm -hmm, she was coming for the interest call. But when I tried to um, send the information over, uh, my question is, do I have to type that out? Because, you know, they fix it on a, like a, who's going to do it and all of that and tag it on the $5 bling boss for us. And I couldn't get that to go. I have, I would have to go out and try to type it in all the information. Oh, you're trying to share the advertisement on the bling beauty on the, uh -huh, the, on the page. Column. Mm -hmm. uh, if email didn't allow you to do that mm -mm. I'm not sure if they have a protection over the screen but I don't think that they would because they're pretty good I didn't good think they did sharing. either but when but I sent it you know the I'll... little share you know the uh, box with the arrow in it is your share button you can go straight to there well what are you trying to share from the social media platform I'm trying to share it from the Bling Boss page. They pin it to the Bling Boss page. Is, is that a private group? Uh huh. That's it's why. a team group. And you might it's be a private to group. Screenshot. And so they tell us to share it, but there's no place for share. It's comment, but no share. Just like so, Robin said, screenshot it. Okay. But the information doesn't come up like that. It's, you get you have her pitch. Whoever's gonna do it, it's their picture, and they're telling you the, about the call. The, they put the call there, but they don't put the information. You when, once you click on it, it's supposed to open up. And so when I sent it, it didn't open up. <laughs> yeah, you probably have to copy both the script mm -hmm. and the photo. Yeah, I tried that, but I, I, I'll get with. Um, my sponsor and see if she knows how to do it because yeah because uh that yeah it depends on your device and your social media platform how mm -hmm. you're sharing it this is a couple of ways yeah yeah put that into the group and ask how do you okay. share from uh because it's a team page how do you share from a team page mm -hmm. because if if i can't find that out i'll just yeah just copy type it. it all in mm -hmm. or, or copy it 
Okay. I tried, do... I tried copying it. It didn't, that didn't work either. So I'm going to call, um, I'll call Karen and see how to get it over there. Nice. Because I'm you, glad you got to go to. Mm -hmm, yeah. She usually posts it in on our, our chat page, but it wasn't there. Oh, okay. the girl, when I called the lady, she said, I didn't get it. It, it. I saw the picture, but I didn't see the rest of it. So she didn't get on. Okay. So, sounds like the interest. Yeah, that's a great follow-up. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. a great follow-up. Use that opportunity to share the information yourself. I'm going to get yeah. she, She's going to get it because I. <laughs> <laughs> she was really she excited. <laughs> <laughs> she, 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 she was really excited about it. She said that she has four children and she's a single mom. And she's working on a job where she don't get to do a lot with her kids. And she she said that she's not making that much money. So she's tr trying to find Ms. another Regina, job. I'm talking to Miss Regina, right? I'm yes. just playing. Yes. <laughs> Miss Regina, the clothes, the clothes. All I see is butter doing the same thing, the clothes. When they're excited, when they're uh, fired up like that, clothes. Mm -hmm. That waiting for that opportunity call may bypass that fire stage. Mm -hmm. If you have to do it yourself is what I'm saying. Provide her with the information. Pull out a Zoom number your, yourself. Hop on the FaceTime. Show us some pictures. Where's your policy and procedure? Show us some pictures. You can do that yourself. You just have to have the confidence. You have the education. You're part of this platform. We give gems every day. So yeah, <laughs> that sounds like she's ready to close. And the longer you wait to make that closing, the flame will start to dwindle. One of my yeah. many mistakes in closing. Yeah, okay. if you know that much about it and she finds this a need and she knows the product is affordable, reasonable, and she knows the need. Yeah, go for it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, so I encourage you. Get her on the line. <laughs> a face. Let me meet you. Are you guys in the same area? Uh, she's in Opelika, and I'm in Birmingham. It's about a two-hour drive. Oh, okay. So maybe you want to jump on something on the social, face-to-face. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I encourage you. Yeah, be encouraged. Go ahead and close on your own. <laughs> okay. Yeah, don't wait. All right. That was good hey, stuff. I'd like to comment on Jermaine. Um, how when she was saying people, if they're not responding, I have found that if they're not responding, um, I will go and share a video, like the five key elements um, that the Frank Divas have and just say hey will you take a minute and watch this um i will check back with you i'll usually give them a couple days and then i'll check back with them and um that way it gives them something to watch um and it seems to have been helping okay thanks keeps them connected to you yeah after a while they'll be looking for things <laughs> Because <laughs> you send them often. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a great connection. Yeah, Tracy says she does that. That's a great connection. Mm -hmm. okay. Thanks, Robin. I try, I try to do the emails when we get the Black Diamond drops or those elite drops. Ooh, look what's coming. Wouldn't you love to have? Yeah, the excitement pushing up. All right, team, six minutes to new releases. <laughs> it's been the season for your girl here, so I have to get on my job. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. All right. Go ahead and prepare, and let's make some reconnections, and tomorrow we'll revisit it. All right. Thanks for logging yeah. the scene, Kelly. Bye -bye. Well, See you guys Thanks later. Here. See you tomorrow. Drop your results in the Facebook group. <laughs> okay.